Hey, hey, beer fans, Denny here. Well, like it or not, we all have a lot more time to spend at home around uh, our breweries these days, so I got a few ideas about things you might want to do. The first thing is take the time to clean and straighten your brewery. Uh, that's what I've been doing. Believe it or not, uh, this is clean and straightened. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. It ain't perfect, but it's better. I got a whole bunch of stuff here that uh, needed to be taken care of. So uh, yesterday I actually pulled out things and cleaned them all off, put them back where they needed to be. And uh, as junky as this looks right now, um, it's a lot better than it was. Another thing I took the opportunity to do was to take inventory of my ingredients. The hops are in a fridge in the house, but you can see here on my grain tubs, a lot of them have labels on them, so I can keep track of how much grain that I actually have left. It's also a really good time to spend more time learning about ingredients. Uh, it's a really, really good time to brew, of course. There's lots of things you can brew, and you've got time to do it now. So if you've got ingredients on hand, spend some time actually brewing. And finally, it's a good time to read a book about brewing, like this one, Simple Home Brewing. It's uh, our newest book, <laughs> and you can get it for, there, you can even see it now. And you can get it for 25% off from Brewers Publications right now. So uh, at least when you're filling your downtime, you can uh, save some money doing it. So let's try and turn a bad situation into a better situation. Get out there in the brewery, check things out, and brew.